What's good? It's Chigozi. It's Tuesday, November 20th, 2017. And NASA has come out with more coded propaganda by the numbers. And since everyone here, even people who aren't even aware of this numerological practice, understand that NASA is nothing else than a big practical joke put on by your federal government, a bunch of liars giving you fake events, fake news. We're going to see how this is no different. This is just another by the numbers propaganda event. Very well, no such thing as this interstellar comet. This is all just literally the Freemasonic actors work at NASA, sat down at a computer, open up their favorite 3D modeling software and you know, giving you this fake bullshit saying it's from something else, saying that it's, they found it and shit. No different than Pixar, you know, making 3D movies, propaganda to lie to you. So right away, we see how it's called Oumuamua, in a Hawaiian name, Barack Obama. And then we have this propaganda updated at 9.22 a.m. Barack Obama, sums to 229, the reflection of that. The 50th prime number, of course, his name with the 32 as well, pairing 52 and 30, the numbers for America. Obama also sums to 32. And then I noticed from Obama's birthday to this event, it happened, of course, 10 slash 19, 2017, Saturn 119, from that to then it is 10 weeks, six days, exactly. Prophecy 106, Omwamwa, Sumshi 106. One ten, just like prophecy. You now think about it, an interstellar, never before seen com asteroid with the prophecy coding. I'm trying to see more like what more does Obama have to do with this? So I see more so a Saturn prophecy ritual, but that those Obama connections couldn't be denied. Oh, Obama also from Hawaii. Per the narrative, very well could be from Kenya, just to mock all of you. Very well could be from Switzerland. You know, you, I don't know. He's an actor, a piece of shit. That's what really matters. We need to put him and his employees and his employers out of power. So here's some notes I got in this. Also, keep in mind, this is updated at 922, 92, 22, the master builder number, 92, number for false, singer of Satan, 29, all that. You know, another CGI image on 119. I gotta type it out just for this ritual. So central. Saturn, some see 119. That's what I'm saying. People from my little peep video. I, how do you not get it? You see all the 119s on him? Fentanyl is what his shit was laced with, his Xannies. And 119. And then now we get NASA propaganda, always Saturnian, because it's NASA space, Saturn Keeper time. And then, of course, this happens on 119. The Pan Stars 1 telescope. This is coded as well. Spotted something strange. Unlike anything astronomers have ever seen before. See, so significant this is on a 119. Just to, you know, keep these in mind. All these numbers are Saturn. So this is when I first clicked on it, updated it at 801, Ritual 81. And you're going to like this. Look at this actor, this Freemason, this Jesuit, Zionist Jew right here, Paul Chodas, the manager at NASA Center for Near-Earth Object Studies. What does that tell you? That all he does is participate in fake bullshit propaganda by the numbers. Look at his name. Paul Choda is an asteroid, you know? Talk about the asteroid. Saturn 73, 
the reflection, 73 to 20 first prime number, Saturn 21. And full reduction in the ALW Saturnian cipher, it sums to 73, 21st prime. And then to, again, check our work, you go to the propaganda, and what do they say? The size estimate, the size estimate is based on how the light reflected by the object varied over the course of roughly 7.3 hour rotational period. All the time, bullshit, propaganda. You know, of course, pairing the 81 with the 27, the minute 27 second video, ritual 27 and 81, and 45, the summer Saturn's marriage square, and 79 and ALW, the 22nd prime, prime number, updating is propping in at 922 by the numbers. Of course, the minute 27 second videos, 127. 31st prime, cube 31, going back to Saturn's cube. Also a branding of Scarlet Rider Freemasonry, the very Illuminati. The Pan Stars 1 telescope. So this is Pan Stars Gematria, and then you add one. Some says 37 like asteroid, Paul Chodas, 64 reflection of 46, which means the Default form of Gematria, you can subtract one and you get those values too. 117, 54. Omoamua again, prophecy numbers, time 47, 25. Putting the time numbers in this. What else can I say? Also, some to the 47th prime number in Frank Deconis, which is capital A is 1, lowercase a is 2, capital B is 3, lowercase b is 4, just like how you learned it in school. Teaching Gematria when you're in kindergarten, your teachers are just too dunce. To tell you this by the numbers. English extended. 142, route 42, you get 142. Freemason, Zionism, Saturn, Jesuit, runs the Catholic Church, 132. Prophecy 52 to reflection of 25. So we get three of prophecy's numbers inside Omuamua. Of course, NASA, some see 17, like space. Space also sums you 20. That's what I'm saying, people. Like, get out of here for with all the theory. This is not a fucking theory that the Freemasons who run NASA, you know, calling themselves NASA, why does NASA sum to 28, 17, and space sums to the same fucking thing? I mean, it cannot be any more perfect. And from the eclipse to that, them finding this fake asteroid with a telescope, 59 days, Freemasonry 59, it's the 17th prime number, space 17, NASA 17, eight weeks, three days, that 83 is the 23rd prime, symbol 23, 83 is also a destructive number, think about a big old asteroid coming out of nowhere, you don't know what it can do. But rest assured, this is just another science project as in not an asteroid as in oh let's log on to our 3d studio max or maya create a asteroid 3d image create some propaganda saying that it was coming on 119 and all the idiots will believe it's real because it came from the propaganda i don't understand what people believe that think look at all the people arguing with me using the narrative as their ammo why would you use the narrative that is obviously fake, that's by the numbers, and use that to, you know, look, 43, a Sonic 43, killing 43, Donald Trump in more assassination programming. Just a few weeks.
the sum of 48's divisors, one, two, four, Donald Trump, 48, no. Death killing murder, 38. Killing, 38, 43. Roy Moore, 38, and the 43 video. With a minute, 18 second video, death, 118. I mean, I mean, people, like, this is, F and Jewish Gematria, 118. I don't know what else you need to see. This is how it always is. I'm not even gonna read that and make this video long. 10 minutes is fine, but that's a nice example. I'm just showing you people how to do it. Why can't the people who don't get this, why can't you just literally copy what I'm doing inside all these articles? I'll show you how these are, this is all fair game. And it's not just CNN. You can go on Snopes, Fox News. It's all fair game, NPR.org. All fair games, all mainstream media, Zionist Jew run, Jesuit order with this Jesuit right here, the red and black propaganda. You know, look, one plus two is three. Another 43. Donald Trump made another 43 update time piece of propaganda. Do you understand why I have example after example with this type of shit? You can't deny anything I show. If you apply the basic rules of numerology and gematria, which is numerology, you will uncover a lot inside mainstream media. That's all I say. And look, numerology, you don't, four, you don't, you don't add it to anything. You don't reduce it to a single digit. One plus two is three, 43. Go to CNN, 43. And it's both, both about Rory Moore. It's both the same thing. They're both in the same fucking article up there at the same fucking time. You know, if that's a coincidence, I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to fucking say. Just, what a perfect example right there. Space 91. I was going to point out all the 19s, the reflection of having this October 19th, the 19 million miles, New Chaos 19. Play more with 19 is ritual. Look, 138. <laughs> Federal 138, 138 plays reflection, 969, 9.69 meters kilometers per second squared is the average orbital speed of Saturn. Donald Trump 138, it's a turning actor. 33, 30 by 30, I mean, 180 meters. <sighs> Initially published at 1141, 41, the 13th prime, Oh man. So yeah, you know, if you want concrete examples, this whole video is full of them, but the last part, I mean, I'm telling you, it's all by the numbers propaganda, how it doesn't matter where you go, it's all fair game. I, I show you how the Roy Moore, Donald Trump propaganda is updated at 430, 43. And then we go to the NPR, the same thing, updated at 412, one plus two is three. If you still don't get it, then you need to just, I, I have nothing to say. You're just a pathetic fucking thinker and you're just better off in the dirt with the rest of these fucking tyrants. Peace off. Peace out. October 19th, 2017, when they spotted this thing on a date with a life lesson number of 39, the reflection of 93, Saturn 93. Saturn 119, Saturn 21, and I did with 21 numerology. 1 plus 0 plus 1 plus 9 plus 2 plus 0 plus 1 plus 7. How do you get 39? You do 1 plus 0 plus 1 plus 9. No, no, no. You do 10 plus 19 plus 2 plus 0 plus 1 plus 7. The one I was going at was this one. They're more so inverses of each other. You can't see what I'm, what I'm going at. 48, I always like to pair this number, you know, propaganda, 9348, Freemason, Illuminati. There was 73 days remaining, Saturn 73, the 21st prime number, Saturn 21. It can't be anywhere fucking perfect. 
Belima Israel Zion 64 reflection of this. I like pairing this with 93 as well. Look, 93 is reflection. Pairing it with the Thelemic number 64 is reflection. Do what thou wilt 64. Prophecy 29. It's Sonic Jewish. Revelation the 66th book of the Bible. And there's revelations coming on it with this revelation numerology. This is the epitome of every fucking shit I do with this date numerology calculator. This is the absolute ripest day for some Saturnian propaganda. 2992, you know, false Zionist Jew nonsense. It's all this. And guess what, guys? They might take this video down just because I had a playlist on my other channel. Not my old channel, but I have a, it's my music channel. I had a, it was like a personal playlist. Like, oh, these are cool NASA exposés. They make a playlist called Exposing NASA. And they deleted that playlist. So don't be surprised if they take this video down because I'm calling out NASA and their fake news propaganda. It is the Masons. Mason, 1728, 73. They were 73 days remaining. They're doing this. Running NASA by the numbers, 73. NASA, 73, and it was 73 days remaining. The 21st prime. Like I'm, I apologize for talking like this if it annoys some of you. But I have no, I, I've, I'm out of options. How else do I get this shit across to the people, the many people? You know, it's not just a few people. Some people still don't get this. This is a perfect fucking example. Run in space by the numbers. No, I'm not a flat earther. No, I just see how my federal government is running NASA and they're doing it by the numbers. I see how they're giving me these fake events on these specific days. If this was real, a real event, it wouldn't have happened on this day. It would happen on a date with much different numerology, would not match this pattern barely at all, or if not whatsoever, but a perfect, absolute perfect day for some bullshit like this by the numbers. So yeah, take my fucking video down if you want YouTube. You've been exposed again. Guys, NASA's propaganda is YouTube's propaganda. It's Australia's propaganda, it's Botswana's propaganda, it's France's propaganda, it doesn't fucking matter, it's Canada's propaganda. Your federal government is the same thing. That's why I call them that. Because it doesn't matter where you fucking live. Peace out.